Hi everyone, today I'm going to be reviewing the brand new Jumbo Lipstick from NARS. It's just really easy to apply. Totally kidding guys. Hi everyone, my name is Estée Lalonde and I am here on the NARS channel to talk to you all about lipsticks. I'm such a lipstick fan and I'm going to be trying on some lipsticks for you today and most exciting part is you can try them on too. I'm not a huge tech person but this is really interesting and really easy to use. I'm going to be trying on these six shades but there are actually 72 lipstick colors from NARS in celebration of their 25th anniversary. That is a long time. Like I mentioned, as I'm trying on these lipsticks, you can actually virtually try them on as well, and it looks so realistic, it's insane. I honestly do not know how they do it. So if you're watching this video, but you're not in the YouTube app, head over to the YouTube app and then click on this video. Underneath this video, right down there, there's going to be a little blue button that says, try it on. And you just click that button, it accesses your camera, and it finds where your lips are, and you can choose from a bunch of different lipsticks to try it on your lips. You can see what the lipstick color will look like on you. And if you really love it, you can go shopping. Shopping, 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 one of my favorite things to do. It works on iOS, it also works on Android. Make sure you're holding your phone in portrait mode and you're good to go. So I'm gonna be trying on some of my favorite lipsticks from this collection. I narrowed it down to six, and let me tell you, it was one of the hardest decisions I've made this week, because they're all gorgeous. So I've split this into three different categories. I'm going to do some nudes. I have a daytime nude and a nighttime nude that I really love. I also have a bright and a dark, and then I have a red, a bright red, and a dark red. The first lipstick I'm going to try on, I have to say, I have no idea how to say it. I'm very bad at pronouncing things, so bear with me, but it's spelled S-C-H-I-A-P, and it's a matte formula. So I'm gonna zoom in so you can really see my face. This lipstick is the most gorgeous, vivid pink, and besides that, it's in a matte formula, which makes it really easy to wear. I'm just going straight in from the bullet. Oh my gosh. How gorgeous is this pink color? I'm obsessed. I'm going to zoom out a little bit. It's so smooth. Like it's matte, but it's definitely not drying. And you saw how easy that was to apply. Wow. That is the cutest color ever. I'm such a nude girl. I pretty much like exclusively wear nudes and sometimes I'll do a pop of color but this is kind of this is kind of legendary I'm not gonna lie I could personally see myself wearing this in the daytime just exactly how I'm wearing my makeup today super minimal makeup look but like a nice bright pop of color I think it is gorgeous I really love this color kind of don't want to take it off but we have five more lipsticks to dry so next up is another really cool color. This is actually a satin formula. So there are matte formulas, satin formulas, and sheer formulas. So this is a satin. It's called Impulse. It looks super dark in the lipstick bullet, but trust me when I say this is actually wearable. Let's just get straight into it. Ooh, there you go. Look at that. Because of its formulation, the satin formula, it's not obviously as opaque as it looks, so it can be misleading. Never judge a lipstick by its bullet. Always gotta swatch it. Or in this case, use the try on button. If you're not trying on lipsticks along with me, please do. I'm just trying to show you a good time here, guys. It is really, really fun. I did it for like three hours yesterday. It's a really brand new technology. It's super cool. So let's just get on this wavelength together. Anyway. I'm gonna keep going. It's lovely and smooth to apply. Oh my gosh, I really need to wear more color. It's so easy. It just glides on the lips and it's so comfortable. I am obsessed. I know I said that about the last one, but I think this one is really great if you're like going on a night out, you wanna be like super 
sexy. I really love this. I don't know why I'm like pushing my face like this, but yeah, I really, really love it. I think it's super chic and just like very, very, very cool. Wow, I adore this one. Once again, this one was called Impulse. Moving swiftly on to nudes, I am going to do Chelsea Girls, which is the one that I chose to be my daytime nude. This is something that I would probably just like finish the entire lipstick because it's one of those ones you can just chuck in your bag, have it all the time, reapply it all day. And you could even wear this at night, obviously, but I would say it's more of a, a daytime nude. This is just the ultimate pinky beige color. Such a my lips but better shade. Mm, I can't get over how creamy these things are. So this is the sheer formula, which means it's just so wearable. I am in love with this. I really am. It is. It feels like it's as hydrating as a lip balm would be. If you can see like just how shiny that lipstick is, imagine that on your lips. Like it's just so gorgeous. Just a quick reminder, if you're trying to use the try on feature in the YouTube app, make sure you hold your phone vertically because it doesn't work landscape. Just a quick trick from somebody who is very technologically challenged. I have Gypsy for you. Sometimes I just want to wear a nude, but I want it to be more visible than just kind of an everyday nude. This is actually described as a berry red, but I would wear this as like a more dramatic nude because it's that easy to wear. It's a simple, super neutral color. You almost don't even know it's red, but there's like a hint of red in it. I think it's just like, maybe nude is the wrong term, a neutral. This is a neutral color. How gorgeous is that? It's like so just pretty. And I hope you guys know what I mean when I say nude. I just mean it's just kind of easy. And it's not a huge statement, but it's like a bit more va va voom than just like your classic nude. This is also a sheer texture. And I think that's probably my favorite, personal favorite texture, just because it's so moisturizing and easy. And by the way, check out this glorious NARS packaging. As always, NARS has pulled it out of the bag with the most gorgeous packaging ever. Next up, I'm gonna go for Ravishing Red. And this is another matte. And it's quite the, quite the color. Um, this makes me a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie, but let's just see what it looks like. Every time I wear bright lipstick, people do compliment me. I should really do it more, just a little more out of my comfort zone. But that's what I love so much about this range of NARS lipsticks. There is really something for everyone. There are so many shades. Again, I cannot get over how just easy and comfortable it feels to apply these onto the lips and they smell so great. There is moringa seed oil in here, as well as passion fruit seed oil. I kind of love this. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of love this. This is definitely one that would be fun for you guys to try on at home. I imagine you're all just kind of chilling, sitting on the couch right now, but imagine what you'd look like in Ravishing Red. This is a unique lipstick because you could wear this in the daytime, just like this, but you could also really dress it up for a night out. I like this a lot. I really like this. Okay, let's move on to the last and final lipstick, Immortal Red. Ooh, hoo, 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 look at this. This is just that iconic crimson red. Look at that. If this does not make you feel glam, I honestly don't know what will. I really just feel like I need to put on like a ball gown and just like saunter up some stairs and then like meet my Prince Charming or something like that. Where's that invite? Where's that Prince Charming? This is stunning. And because this is a matte texture, it's gonna be super long lasting. Like one of those ones you can wear all night long. That is so pretty. That is so pretty. So pretty. I love it. All right, guys, that is a wrap for my NARS lipstick try on video. I really, really, really enjoyed doing this for you. And oh my God, look at this lipstick. I love it. If you haven't already clicked that blue try on button just underneath this video in the YouTube app, give it a go. Rewind this video, find your favorite shade that I tried on and just 
let's see what it looks like on you. You might love it. You might hate it. But it's always good to check these things. Out of the 72 lipstick colors as part of this collection, you can virtually try on 24 of them. Every single lipstick that I mentioned is available in that try on feature, so that's really fun. I would love to know which one of the lipsticks that I tried on in this video is your favorite. Which one do you think looks best on me? I honestly think it's this one, which I would not have believed. I really thought Chelsea Girls was gonna be my ultimate favorite, but I think this is a winner. It's so easy. Imagine just like, cute little ponytail and like, oh hey, I just wear red lipstick all the time. I might have to start because this is so cute. If you fall in love with any of these lipsticks, take a picture, post it on Instagram. I'd love to see them. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.